What's going on guys, Austin Nerd Show here, and today we're opening more Pokemon cards. We've got the brand new set here of the Sun and Moon Celestial Storm. So this is of course the brand new set. So usually when I do um, openings of new uh, packs, I get the booster box first. Uh, of course I open this usually on the same day just because I want the book out of this. But unfortunately wherever I ordered the booster box from on Amazon has not got here yet. So at the time of opening this, I do not have the box. So you'll probably see the booster box next week. So if you want to see a whole booster ba box opening, be sure sure to check the channel next week and we will have that but today we just have the elite trainer box going on here and first off I love the look of this this dark green with the gold and then the like neon green here in this like center and stuff I love that and of course the Rayquaza just fits and everything but this is an elite trainer box so we will get all of this four pack or sorry eight packs of the um, new celestial storm packs and of course all sorts of stuff there with the Rayquaza and everything so let's go ahead and get into it and we'll go through all the stuff that's inside okay so let's go ahead and pull on off the sleeve here so there we got the book which we will look at at the end so we got the box there we'll sit that so let's go ahead and look at the poster here to see um i always say to see what's on it but obviously it's just all the cards um uh, artwork from the booster pack so here so there we've got one of the um i forget what they call it. i've i haven't played uh, sun and moon for so ultra beast i think is what that's called there i think that's what that is i don't know what its name is or anything i can't remember what it is but i think that's what it is been so long since I've done uh, Sun and Moon stuff like play the games and everything and we don't get the cards that often so it's hard to tell but we've got that thing then it's Jirachi uh, Brazik or yeah Blaziken sorry and then we've got um, Rayquaza there at the top that looks really cool I really like this I like besides the um, thing here at the bottom I really like each of these Pokemon in their artwork so that's cool so let's go ahead and bring the box back over so there we've got the, of course the Rayquaza head there oh wow they've even redone the packaging here so it's now like a whole used to just be a bunch of like cardboards like hard cardboard stuff on the inside and now they have this whole like setup with that design that looks that looks really cool and i like how they like you know it's got the designs help keep everything separate and everything so that's really cool it's like i like that in the back there so there we've got our eight booster packs here so there are the boost packs there of course we'll be opening those at the end what else do we got here at the dice oh those look cool I like it because they have like the green that's supposed to be inside looks ha has like a bluish tint to it like inside the numbers and stuff so that looks really cool of course there's the logo for the set and then of course the big dice there and then we've got our GX and our damage car uh, coins there so we got that then we've got the uh, card or code for the pack which I'll be keeping that one but I will be showing all of these so if you want the codes you can prepare to get that then we've got the Rayquaza dividers there Ooh, it's Rayquaza on both sides usually it's got like Celestial Storm on one side then the artwork then of course our pack of energy which we don't need and then our divider or our card sleeves here with again Rayquaza that looks really cool I really like that so that is everything out of the box we'll on this put that back there and hopefully we have room for all this stuff we'll just sit there there i really like that artwork i wish it was like a big thing i could stick in the back here um so let's go ahead and throw everything we don't need we'll just set it off to the side up here um hopefully it'll all stay obviously you can't see it on camera but hopefully it all stays up there and let's go ahead and get into our packs here um so yeah, we'll just yeah open them in the order they got. And I've already opened two packs of these, and I got a good card already that I'll tell you about um, at the end. But then a uh, card that's not so good. So let's hope we get some good stuff out of this box. So let's get into it. We'll start off with our first pack here, where we've got a Mudkip, Slugma, Beldum. I love the artwork on these. They did really good. And this artwork here on Larvitar looks like the old original Pokemon, like from Gen 1 cards. So that's really cool. A Whalmer, a Rare Candy as our Reverse Holo, and a Clay Doll as our Rare Pokemon. It's Fairy Energy, Tate, Liza, uh, or Liza, sorry, Bill's Maintenance, Cacturn, and the Code. Then our next pack, we've got a Mudkip, Slugma, Beldum, wow, this exact same pack, Larvitar, Whalmer, yep, keeping all the same. Oh, we got a Swampert Reverse Hall. That is awesome there that we got that. So we got that. I'll set that aside just because I like that. Oh, and we got a Steelix Hollow. That looks so cool. This looks like the older close to the old original Steelix card that I used to have from when Gen 2 first came out. So that's awesome. We'll keep those cooler cards like that aside, of course. Then we got Dark Energy, Masquerain, a How Trainer card, Underground Expedition, and our code. Here we go, starting out a little bit different. We've got a Torchic, Slackoth with its red butt there for some reason, a Shuffit, Trico, 
Cacnea, a Volbeat Reverse Hollow, and a Mag Cargo as a rare non hollow or anything. Then we got a Psychic Energy, Pelipper, Sky Pillar Trainer, a Dunsparce, which looks cool. I like that artwork, and our code. Next up, we got Torchic, Slackhoth, Shepard, again, starting out the same cards, Trico, Cacnea, a Loudred, Reverse Hollow, and a, De oh, a Deoxys as a rare. Not hollow or anything, but that's still cool that we got a Deoxys. That is awesome there. Um, Grass Energy, Lantern, Switch Trainer, which I like the Switch that they actually have Pokemon on now, which they may have been in the past, but usually, since I've been opening packs recently, they've always been just Pokeballs, so it's cool they threw Pokemon in there. A Loudred and the Code. Halfway through now, we've got a Love Disc, Electric, C Dot, Wingle. So these are all different cards now. A Spoink, a Lure of All, Reverse Hollow, and a Cartana Ultra Beast. There, that looks cool. Of course, the card um, Ultra Beast there. It's like a little card, it's super tiny, and everything. That's really cool that we got that. Then we got a Fighting Energy, a Huntail, a Grove Isle, Energy Switch, again with more Pokemon, and our Code. This time we start off with Larvitar, Slackoth, Love Disc, Electric. C dot. Oh, we got a Latios Prism Star. That is cool. Look at that Latios there with the Prism Star and everything. That looks so cool. So we'll set that aside definitely. Then we've got a Registeel as a rare non hollow or anything, but still looks really cool. Then we got Steel Energy, Lise, L Lysia. I don't know how to say that name. A Torkoal, Oricorio, and our code. Next up, we got a Beldum, Whalmer, Spinarak, Larvitar. Slackoth, Electric Reverse Hollow, and another Deoxys non hollow again as a rare there. So we've already got doubles, Fighting, or sorry, Dark Energy, Oricorio, Swalot, Copycat Trainer, and the Code. And from our last pack here, we got a Shuppet, Mudkip, Beldum, Whalmer, Spinarak, Reverse Hollow Larvitar. Let's see if we get something good. We haven't got anything really good or amazing out of this set. Let's see. Nope, we got a Delamize there as a rare, not even hollow or anything. So another not good set for us. Then we got Fire Energy, a Mawile, Acro or yeah, Acro Bike, Last Chance Potion, and our code. So we didn't really get anything good. These are the only cards I consider to be pretty good out of the set. So we did get the Latios Prism Star, probably our best card out of this set there. The Prism Star, because you know it's more of a rare card than the others. Then we got a Hollow Steelix and a Reverse Hollow Swampert, probably the best cards we got out of the set. Unfortunately, no ultra, uh, Super Rares, Ultras, whatever you call it, no GXs or anything. But in that other packs I did open, I did get a GX, so we'll go ahead and look in the book here just to see what cards we could have got and what we'll be looking Looking forward to once we open the booster box again that I'll be opening probably next week once I get the booster box and everything so it'll be probably next Monday so here of course is all our grass oh so we got some more bell sprout uh, family or evolution set there scyther which is cool um, I always like bell sprout up to victory bell and everything and then oh we got a shiftery GX there um, pretty much basic cards there. Are a lot of Gen 2 stuff going on here. Trophius and everything. Then we get into Fire, and there's what I got. I got the Blaziken GX card there, so that's cool that out of the first sets, I, or first pack I opened, I got that, so that was awesome. There's two Torchics there, so I'll have to be on the lookout for those. Ooh, an Articuno GX. That'd be awesome as well. Oh, we got a Low Tad family going on there with the Dancing Ludicolo. No other GXs on that page. Ooh, we've got a GX Electro. That'd be awesome to get, too. I love, of course, anything Gen 1 is what I'd want. Ooh, we got a Plusle and a Minute with both in the artwork. Oh, <laughs> GX Mr. Mime. That is funny. I want that card now. I really do. Um, let's see. Any other? We've got two weird Shepard Arts. I only got one of those. We got a Binette down there. So you got a regular Binette. And oh, so we got different forms of Deoxys. Of course, we got the same one, unfortunately. So one's a Hollow Rare. And then we got the other two rare. And then Lunala is a rare there. Hollow rare. Yeah, that Don yeah, that Fanfi there and that Don fan are the original artwork. Then probably those are too. Because yeah, I, I had definitely had the Fanfi and the Don fan there. So that's definitely the old artwork. Palosan GX over here. Eradicate GX, which would be cool to get that as well. And a Scizor GX. Like I said, a lot of, almost all these are Gen 2 with a couple of others thrown in there. Then we have a Jirachi Prism Star, which we didn't get. We did get the Latios, though. Then there's that thing. I can't see what it says. Stakataka, maybe? Stakataka GX is maybe what's called there. Looks cool as well. Then we got the um, bag on forms there. Then we got Latios and Latios, or Latios and Latios. We got Latios, of course, in this set. We've got a Rayquaza GX, which is what I really want and be cool to get. Then we've got our last set of Pokemon here. 
until we get into all our trainers and it, energies and all that sort of stuff. Then, of course, we've got our rares. So there's, of course, the full arts there, which, God, all of those looks really cool. Then our full art trainers, which is what I like to collect. I haven't been getting them the past couple of sets, though, just because money and everything. But there's, what, eight of them in this set? That's crazy, as many as there are. Then, of course, a bunch of gold going on there which is crazy so that's gonna be it for this set of celestial storm our elite trainer box here again don't forget to check out the booster backs probably next monday i don't know what the date is or i'd say it but it's whatever the monday after the following is watching this video so be sure to check out our booster box and see if we hopefully can get some more gx's and other rare cards going out of there but i hope you enjoyed this unboxing if you did let me know in the comments down below let me know which card i got that you thought was the best you know it didn't get many but just let me know what your opinion was and don't forget to subscribe to see more Pokemon card openings, and we'll see you next time.